so I've been doing a lot of reading. Currently I'm reading Stiff by Mary Roach. It's 274 pages, which kind of is like, I'm surprised I haven't finished it yet, but I'm thinking it's because I'm reading another book at the moment too. It's called Discovering You by Melissa Keene, and it's 1,226 pages. And right now I'm at about 1,011, I'm pretty sure. But I've been reading it for a couple days, and it's pretty good. It's kind of consumed me. Like, I'll get home from school, I'll read, stop for like a half hour, do my homework, and I'll start reading again. Before I started reading Discovering You by Melissa Keene, I was reading Hired by the Cowboy by Donna Alward, and it's 144 pages. And I, it's a free book on Nook, which is good, and I'm pretty sure you can probably find it free on the internet too. And it's a good book for a free book. Note how I said for a free book. I mean, it's a good book, but I would not pay more than like a couple bucks for it. But it's free, so it's, it's a good book if you're looking for a nice free book on your Nook to read. I also started reading books by Jessica Sorensen, and this is where most of my reading happened because I have started the Darkness Fall series, which I think is two or three books. And I've read two of them, so I've either started or finished. It's an apocalyptic book. Uh, zombies, well not zombies, vampires, but it's the same as a zombie apocalypse, only it's a vampire apocalypse kind of. Um, I also read this Fallen Star series, and I'm pretty sure I posted pictures on the blog of the covers. And it's four books in the series. The first one, 700 pages and the other three are around 200 and the first one's free and the rest of them are like 99 cents each except for the last one I think is two dollars but they're so good like if you like fantasy books it's about a girl and she's a star like a fallen star is put in her and like a bunch of people from different worlds are wanting the star's power and she's like meeting up with a kid she like forgot existed and I don't know, it's a good story. And then there's a spin-off series called The Lost Soul. I don't know if it's a series or just a book, but I started reading, I've read The Lost Soul, which is the first book. And I don't know if there's any more books, or if she's planning on writing any more books, but she should because they are really good. And I've started the series of The Secret of Ella and Micah, which are super cute too. It's like girl goes off to college to run away from her problems, her best friend's behind, they meet up and her college roommate's there who knows a completely different girl. I don't know. I suggest you read it. They're so good. Also, if you notice, I've changed the blog a little bit. Um, I'm, I think it's, it'd be down there. Maybe it's down there. I don't know which way. It's on the side, the sidebar of my blog. And if you look below, like, the about me and everything, there's, like, RSS, submit, ask, whatever. You can go and submit, and you can s submit, like, a book title, a book picture, whatever. And I would, I will probably look into reading it, or I will read it, and I will review it for you. And if you have it on your Nook, and it has the Lend Me feature available, which you'll know because it'll be the book cover, like, there, and then there'll be a little banner across that says Lend Me. You can use that to lend the book to me so I won't have to buy it. Uh, my Barnes & Noble email is tracyannhook at hotmail.com. No spaces. I'll put the link, like, it in the description and, like, right here. Maybe. Maybe above my face. Oh, it'll be in this area. It. Because it's spelled kind of weird. Because my name's different than everyone else's. But... Also, in the ask box, if you have any questions for me or if you'd like to disagree with one of my opinions on the book, put it there. And I will look into it and I will feature some of them in here because I would love to contradict some of your arguments about my arguments. Because, ooh, I have strong opinions. <laughs> okay, well, that's it. And suggest me some books to read because I'm starting to run out of stuff. Well, not really. I have like, I bought so many books, it's ridiculous. But no, like, follow me. If you like reading anyway, if you don't like reading, I suggest you don't follow me, but yeah. Bye guys.